before we look at how our tadpoles are doing today, I want to consider some of the other places that frogs and toads lay their eggs, because they don't all lay them in the water. The European common frog, like this one, lays their eggs in water in these large clusters. And a lot of frogs do that, but not all of them. There's some that live in the rainforest that will lay their eggs in little pools of water inside the centre plants, called bromeliads, like this frog here. Others will dig a hole somewhere where it's damp, lined with moss, and lay their eggs in that. And then when the tadpoles hatch, they'll take them out and take them down to the water, so they'll actually carry their tadpoles around. And this helps protect their eggs from predators while they're in the water. Others, like this, will build what's called a nest, a nest made of foam. This is from secretions from the adult frogs. They whip them up with their legs and they lay their eggs within the foam that they make. And these will hang from trees above water. And when the eggs hatch, they'll drop out into the water where they'll become tadpoles. Others, like this midwife toad, will actually carry their eggs around with them. So they carry their eggs on the back, and you can see them in the back here. But the weirdest one of all is called the gastric breeding frogs. And they look like this. And what they actually do, you can look and just see a tiny little frog inside the mouth of the adult frog. And this isn't being eaten. What these frogs do is when their eggs are laid, the male or sometimes the female will take the eggs and hold them in their stomach. And the tadpoles will hatch in their stomach and they grow in the stomach. They're not going to get eaten. They grow in the stomach and they turn into frogs and then they burp out. So the frogs are actually coming out from inside the adult frog's stomach. And obviously they can't eat during any of this time. So these are the really weird ways that other frogs lay their eggs and raise their tadpoles. So we'll, what we'll do now is we'll go back and look at how our tadpoles are doing today. So here we are on day 29. And you can see the tadpoles swimming away and feeding on the plants or in the water and the lettuce leaves. This is going to be a short video today. The main thing I want you to look at is their size. Now, I've stuck the five pence coin to the side of the tank again. Last time I did this, their full length was about half the width of that five pence coin. Now you see as they swim past, they're the full length of it. So they've doubled in size in about the last eight days or so since I shot that video. And they'll keep on growing at this rate doubling in size every 8 to 10 days until they get really really big so they'll end up being several times the width of that 5 pence coin and that's when they'll start turning into frogs. So come back when we do the next video, it's probably going to be another 4 or 5 days before we do another video and we'll see how much they've grown between now and then. I'll just leave it running for a bit so you can see a few more of them swimming around and then we'll leave it there for the day.